Hi, I'm Brandon Van Camp, and this is Ford Inches TV, and I'm here interviewing Brandon Foster. All right, Brandon, and he is teaching here at the Gateway Dance Theater in uh, East Village in downtown Des Moines. And I'm going to ask him just a couple questions. So let's get started. First question: Why do you dance? Uh, I guess basically, I mean, dance gives you the way to express feelings you can't really do in person or you can't really say or write down. It kind of sort of, for me, and it's escape from life. Um, I mean, I have a real job at the moment until I move to LA and I can't really always, you know, dance all the time. So when I dance, it's a way for me to express myself, for me to get, you know, stress out. But more importantly, it's just, it's what I love to do. I mean, it's at the end of the day, that's all I think about. That's all, you know, I want to do. That's, it just, it encompasses my life and I enjoy you know, the artistic side of it. I enjoy just how how vast and different dance is. I mean, you have hip hop, you have ballet, and I mean, I respect all types of dance. I mean, there are people that will um, discredit other types of dance just because maybe they don't have respect for it. Um, but in my theory, if, if you're good at your craft and you're good at what you do, it's it's beautiful no matter what type of dance you do. So um, it's, just, it's just my respect for dance in itself. Not only hip hop, but just all areas of it. And it's, it's fun, man. It's good exercise, if yeah. anything. All right. Okay. Next question. When and where did you start to dance? Uh, well, I'm, a, I'm originally from Iowa. Uh, I grew up in the Quad Cities in Davenport. And I'd say about age of 12, I started break dancing. Um, I've always been into music. And I was a choir boy and show choir and stuff growing up. So um, I always liked to dance. I always enjoyed doing it uh, through school activities. And then uh, me and my buddy started seeing break dancing on TV back in, oh man, I can't remember. It was probably early 2000s. Um, well, actually, I was 12, so it was way before then. Um, we started doing a little bit, and strictly just breakdancing, we got into it in the Chicago scene and stuff. And uh, I think probably when I hit my late teens, early 20s, when I started doing choreography and started getting more into the, uh, the actual dance world business side, not just the breaking, but, um, you know, the, the, the whole business side of it, the industry side, where, you know, you your videos and your conventions and you know, your auditions for agencies and stuff like that. Um, and that's kind of how I started. Uh, there was a gap in between, you know, my breakdancing days and my choreography days, but um, it started a long time ago. I never really grew up in this studio. I never did the whole studio thing where, um, you know, you're trained since you were like eight. You know, I kind of did my own training. We went to local battles, like freestyles and stuff like that, through freestyle sessions and stuff like that uh, back when I was in my teens and stuff. But um, it started back then. Yeah, it started back when I was, when I was a young teenager, adolescent, I guess you could say. I've been dancing ever since. All right, that was a nice long history. <laughs> that's good, that's good, that's good. You're trying to find your roots. All right, last question. What do you enjoy about dance? What I enjoy about dance? Um, I think just because no matter, no matter who you are, whether you're a dancer, whether you're you know, an engineer, whether you're a sports athlete, I think dance is just a way for everyone to escape. It's a way for everyone to, to uh, you know, like I, I'm trying to trying to word this in a way that it sounds somewhat educated. Well, I guess I'll bag it back. My favorite de definition of dance is dance is what music should look like. So you, know, you hear a song, and I think the the perfect piece of choreography, the perfect piece of dance into a song is if you were to imagine that song in a you know physical form, how a person would you know act that out or groove that out. That's what I think dance is. It's it's what that music looks like in person because you can't really draw music or well, you can write music notes yeah. but <laughs> but i'm saying like in a physical form um that's kind of what i like most about dance and that's that's what excites me about dance is you know dance can bring you to tears i mean you know how music can bring you to tears you know that perfect song in a movie i think dance can do the same thing for you if you hit that perfect dance that perfect choreography to that song and you just hit it right on the button you know it can just settle across all these emotions so that's that's what I enjoy most about it, is the is the impact that dance has on on pretty much everything. All right, and that'll be all the questions I have for Brandon. Uh, do you have a YouTube channel that people can check out? Uh, yes, it is. Uh, oh man, what is it? <laughs> you don't remember your own YouTube channel? Well, I, j I just recently uh, changed. I didn't change it, but um, I updated it because I got I got copyright infringed. Boo YouTube. I mean, not boo YouTube. YouTube's amazing, but. I took my older YouTube down. Um, it is. <laughs> it's uh, it's Brandon Foster. I think it's just what it is. Okay. I don't think there's any special. Uh, yes, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just Brandon Foster. Uh, but if you if you YouTube Brandon Foster choreography, Brandon Foster dance, uh, my YouTube handle will come up. 
and, uh, and yeah, that's how you can find me. All right, don't worry about it. We'll put your uh, YouTube link in the description and probably yes. a sample video that you have on your channel. We'll yeah. put it up on the end of this video Makes and sense. some of your, you know, <laughs> clips from, you know, whatever you're going to be teaching here today at Gateway Dance Theater. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, thank you for the interview. I uh, hope you make it big out in L.A. Yes, that's, <laughs> that's my dream. We're yep. going, we're moving. All right, dreams were made. <laughs> so, yep, Brandon Foster, go check him out. Link in the description and we'll put out the other dancers at the end of this video. So, Sport Answer TV. And thanks for tuning in. Peace. See ya.